<laughs> okay, let's start. <laughs> First let I do crazy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Deutschland. In Deutschland. This is Carola und ich bin Liv. Yes. Und zusammen haben wir Konmose.com <lacht> und, und Sigmund ist in the room here. <lacht> Sigmund ist in the room <lacht> hier neben. <lacht> hier neben. Yes. 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 Zu einem Zimmer, ein Zimmer hier neben. So, let's switch to English. Yes, so everyone can understand us. <laughs> we had our first day at Weekend of Hell and we're psyched. Yes, we are so psyched. Well, at first I thought like Weekend of Hell was only opening at 12 today and then it would last until about 6. So I thought we wouldn't get a lot of things done today. There were a lot of Q&A we wanted to see and one photo op, so I thought, well, we'll be lucky if we see those Q&A and do yeah. a photo op and that's it. And you just came out of your egg, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were a little bit, <laughs> what did you say? Land, we have to land yeah. first. I really yes. had to land, and I was like feeling, when we, when we entered, yeah, we drove a while and it was just, yeah, you have to wake up a little, and we were not feeling that uh, chatty yet. And we so almost died well, on and, the way. Yeah. <laughs> we almost died. It was a bumpy road. It was very bumpy. We, we, we had a dangerous road. Yeah. Yeah. We, we almost died twice, but one time... <laughs> <laughs> one time really. Yeah, really. Almost. Oh my god. Yeah. Now I can laugh about it, but I was... I was I was quite shocked at the moment. There was a truck. There was a truck. <laughs> he didn't see us, I think. No, we were driving on the left lane. We were driving like road. this. Yeah. And then this truck just went like... <laughs> and then luckily, this was on the brakes in time. So we didn't really crash. No, but the... But <laughs> it was, it my was heartbeat close. went like... Yeah. Yeah. So, so after that you get a dip, and that's what we had. Yeah, I think. that's when we had uh, when we arrived at weekend of hell. Yeah, the after so, adrenaline dip. Yeah, so we were still psyched, but just like yeah. okay, curious. Let's see what we get done today, and probably do a lot tomorrow. And and we started quietly. We did a lot today. Yeah, <laughs> but we we started slowly. Yeah, yeah. We just walked Coffee, around, yes. went to see the actors, just. Yeah, I walked around a bit, checked everything out, we went to see the merch. Yeah. And, oh yeah, first thing we did, almost first thing we did, was uh, buy a photo op for Tommy Flanagan. Yes. Because that was the one thing we knew for sure. For the ones who don't know, Tommy Flanagan plays the role of Tibbs in Sons of Anarchy. In Cicero, in Gladiator, and... But, oh, I don't know his name in brief or but... Yeah. yeah, and he also plays in Revenge. Yes, and in Peaky so Blinders. And, oh we can God, keep, yeah. keep going on if you like to, just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but so, yeah, I thought I, I'm happy if we do some Q&A and then have a photo of with Tommy and then we'll see what we get done tomorrow. Yeah. So, we went to the photo op. We first did two Q&A, right? We saw the Q and A Freddy versus Jason. Of Freddy versus Jason, yes, which included uh, Zach Ward. Yes. Ken Persinger. Yes. And oh my God, Brandon Fletcher. Brandon Fletcher. Yes. And that was pretty cool. Yeah, that was very nice. 
There were two couches this year. They were sitting on yeah. two couches. That was cool. That was and the table was yeah. just really relaxed. I yeah. Think. So that that was great. And then oh yeah, then then it was Tommy Fleming and Q and A. So we first saw his Q and A. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. 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 Uh, did we know how to ride a bike before you start the show, or did you have to learn that? I'd love to see yes, but no, it's terrible. <laughs> Not as bad as one permanent line can see. He was a boss. There's actually one, there's one episode, I'm not sure what season, but Ron dropped his bike so many times that they had to turn it on a special rig, a camera, a camera rig. And he's riding his motorcycle and he's smoking a cigar and he just lifts the cigar and keeps smoking the cigar. How the bike kept going? <laughs> Ronnie, that's a problem. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> and then we had some dinner or lunch. Lunch, of course. It was two. <laughs> and then it we was did a the lot of Oh, it was a lot of fries. They're yeah. still, They're still swimming. Dancing around in here. <laughs> it was too much. But then again, we'll eat it tomorrow again. Oh, yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so and then we went to the photo op of Tommy Flanagan. But by that time, we hadn't done that much except for seeing the Q&A walking around a bit. So then my nerves starting to kick in. I was like really, really, really nervous. I was like <laughs> totally freaking out because I really like the character of Tids in Sons of Anarchy. And then just standing in the queue made me go crazy. I was pretty relaxed in the queue, but when I stepped up to the to the when it was your turn and I was waiting, I was constantly, of instantly, poof. Yeah. It was, it was, yeah. Yeah. So, but it was, he was nice. He was yeah. very nice. It was a great photo op and he, he would ask your name and, and uh, the, the talk a bit. So it, it, it didn't feel really hurried. And he, he took a bit of time to make it worth uh, that you were doing a photo op with him and that it feel, didn't feel like, okay, rushed, you know? Yeah. And then, yeah, while I was walking away, I decided, well, I want to say something more. So he was just still holding me like this for the photo. And then I just said, oh, you're great. And he was like, yeah, thanks. <laughs> he just squeezed my arm a bit. And I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, and well, I, oh, I had an embarrassing <laughs> moment. <laughs> I I suddenly switched to German. I I really don't know why because he he's not German. I'm not German, and I said Danke <laughs> <laughs> instead of thank you. I don't know why. I was very psyched, but yeah, it was cool. And then we uh, Sean Patrick Flannery was interacting. Yeah, wow. Time. He has so much energy. <laughs> Hast du I was really amazed. gelesen? <laughs> <laughs> he was asking that, that to everyone. Yeah. Yeah. But it was fun to, to see him there and, and he was really talking to everyone, connecting with people and, and yeah, and quite unique. So, yeah. but, but we didn't yet talk to him because we were quite rushed. Since uh, James Remar would start with his Q and A right after Tommy's um, photo op, yes. so we rushed in. So I went down to Coney Island and uh, I looked around and there was just one guy in these ball toss games throwing the ball and knocking a couple of guys down. He was about my size and build, so I, you know, I put down the board, played the game a couple of times, and I started talking to him. I was talking to him about Coney Island. Ultimately, my final question was, what kind of people live down here? And he stretches his arms out like this, and he says, the worst kind. And that was uh, my key into the park, just the worst kind. And then
then we thought we had all kinds of Q&A <laughs> after that. But then after James Remar's Q&A, everyone just disappeared from the room and we were like, why is everyone now We were sitting like leaving? two little ducklings. Yeah, right? so just the two like, of us there like, waiting for the new <laughs> Q&A. Yeah. But then, at a certain moment, we checked the schedule, and the next Q and A would come after an hour. Yes. So that that <laughs> opened up a whole new it was a new way of new. possibilities yes. to us. <laughs> like, okay, we have an hour. What are we going to do with it? Yeah. And we we took the moment and we we interacted like hell. Yeah. We did. <laughs> <laughs> We really did a lot, yeah. We, uh, and it was great. Yeah, it was Sybil Danning. Uh, yes. Pahula wrote a piece about her on our website. Yeah. So check it out. It was uh, for an event, but that was cancelled, so that's... Yeah, but she's on a whole shame. tour uh, yeah. in, in Europe. So we, we talked to her quite a long time. I will write about it separately. And we also talked to the guy who... who um, who guided her tour, who, who made everything happen. So that that was very, very it's interesting. From Exalt? Yeah. yeah. Exalt TV. Yeah. So that that was really nice. We had a great conversation yeah, there. And it was, was actually was pretty cool. Pretty long. Yeah. yeah. She really had she the, time the time and, yes. and she told us so much so many things. Yeah, we will write about it because otherwise this this vlog will take like <laughs> an hour. <laughs> so and then after that I think we first went to see another Q and A, right? Yeah, we did the, the two Q and A's. Yeah. We did the Boondock the Saints, Boondock Saints and the Sybil Danning. Yeah, the Boondock Saints Q and A was of um, Sean Patrick Flannery and uh, I'm leaving it up David, to you. <laughs> David De La Roca. Yes. And it was a very chaotic Q and A. I thought it was. Yeah, it was, it was Sean Patrick strange. Flannery was was. Psyched. He was. He was. He had all over, over the place. Yeah, and Dave De La Roca. I think he was a little jet lagged or something yeah, like that. I he think was so. A, was a little. It was a bit quiet and sleeping and... at one moment. <laughs> I think. Uh, how rough was the shooting for you? I mean, there's there's a lot of action there. Like when you guys jump out of the window and all that. Um, was it like really rough shooting or was it like any other shooting? It was all CGI. Okay. Computer generated animation. Uh, Reese, he's, he's one of my best friends on the planet. Um, he's got his motorcycle in my garage. Okay. You know, I, I talked to him. I, I just sent him a text uh, today because I don't know if I saw this t shirt, but uh, I just said, look, here's the text that I just sent him right now. And it was about this dude that had a t shirt called The Spanking Dead. You see that? And it's a dude, chick bit over a dude's spank ass. I just sent him that. But it was it was a cool Q and A to it see, was, and it was nice. Good yeah. Saints is one of my favorite movies, so yeah, it was great to see how fun. great Sean Pat Patrick Flannery is. Yes. So I wanted an autograph, but Please. first we watched the Q and A of Natasha Hamstridge. Oh, Natasha Hamstridge. Species. We did species. Species. We did species. Her species. Too. One, two, and three. Yeah, one, two, and three. Yeah. yeah. So we listened to her Q&A. Um, sorry, I, I gotta park you out. Just walk up those four stairs. That's a bad sign, right? <laughs> <laughs> we'll keep it a, keep a bit shorter. And then we also <laughs> went to the Q&A of Sybil Danning. Yeah. And, and then, then we thought everyone... Yeah, we thought would everyone have would have left this. by then because it was way past six and I thought, well, most of the actors will probably want to go to their hotel right now and usually when you come out of the last Q&A, everyone's gone. <laughs> but but this time... No, they were all sitting there. Yeah. Sean Patrick Flannery was... Yeah, he was... He, he has Still seen, energetic. Yeah. Still <laughs> interacting with everyone. <laughs> to everyone. Hast du den Blog gelesen? Yes. <laughs> so, Sigmund, actually... <laughs> Bless you, Sigmund. My uh, God. <laughs> yeah, I walked up to him and said, uh, "We have a blog also, <laughs> yeah. so we're gonna that write so about awesome. you." So, <laughs> but I was standing in the in the queue already for for the yeah. autograph, and we had 
Pool bubbles. Yes. And pool bubbles. <laughs> Which is kind of like, for the people who don't know who are not Dutch, it's typically Dutch. And it's like two cookies, two small waffles <laughs> with, syrup. with some caramel syrup, yeah, syrup. Uh, between it. Yeah. And it's it's typically Dutch. It's and it's and I mean everyone, everyone loves it. Everyone loves yeah. it. I don't. By the way, I I, hate I think it. it's I think it's too fine. too sweet. Oh, what are you hiccups. doing? <laughs> the hiccups. It's terrible. <gasps> you talk. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, we gave it to Sean Patrick Flannery, and that was a great moment. He was yeah he was. <laughs> You, yeah, no, I, I'm speechless. I'm really speechless. He, he's so cool. I love him so much and I hope he will read uh, the article on the website. He said he would, so we'll make that sure nice. he's aware that if we you, wrote about if him. If you see this, <laughs> comment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would that love. would make our day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. Hello, if you get. <laughs> ah, I'm, I'm learning my German. What are they? Oh, 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 it's, a it's a sort of cookie with caramel in between. Yeah, yeah, and everyone loves it. Well, thank you. I won't open it now at all. <laughs> Thank you very much. And this is your blog? Yeah. I will check it out. So, um, yeah, that was cool. And after that, we also have Drop. That's for those who... <laughs> drop. For those of you who don't know, that's uh, Dutch candy. It's it's licorice, I think yeah. they, they call it. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's black it's, and it has a strange it's taste. Black. <laughs> yeah, I like yeah. it. It's this one. It's, it's this. okay. This is the one. Yeah, but you really, yeah, I can't imagine that if you taste it for the yeah. first time, you, you do hate like it. it. Yeah. But it, it is, it is very nice. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, and we had some more straw baffles. And straw baffles, yes. And we, we decided to walk up to Tommy Flanagan and just give it to him for yeah. shame and... We brought it as a present for him, but as you might know, at a photo op it's impossible to, to give a present, it's not even allowed. So we just went to his table and gave him the presents. He was nice. He was very he nice. Was very he was nice. very happy yes. and thankful and yeah, we couldn't have wished for more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So that was day that one. Was, that was awesome. Yeah, and was there was even one. more. Because when you went out for a smoke, oh, yeah. Zygmunt and I went talking to Tom Atkins. I'm not doing that again, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> we talked to Tom Atkins, which was, which was quite nice as well. We just talked a bit about how busy it was and then a small talk about his movies, etc. We didn't buy an autograph, but we just had a little chat. So we'll write about that and his Q&A uh, some more, probably. Yeah, and he was earlier uh, in the yeah. movie, he was, <laughs> I was yeah. making a picture was another of funniest Jason moments. Lively, Lovely, I don't know how you yeah. pronounce it, yes. And lovely, then, I think. <coughs> I already made a picture of... Um, Tom Atkins Tom Ad before. Oh my god, I, I, I almost said can for me, I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I was making a picture of him and, and he was, hey, 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 what about me? <laughs> so he, he posed like this and you'll see the picture somewhere. Yeah, in, in we'll post article. it. But it was, that was very cool. Yeah, yeah, that was very nice. Lou Temple was also interacting and... Yeah, yeah they, they, that's that's what we love about Weekend of Hell yes. and about the We're Friday. So close to yeah. everyone and at Friday it's 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 quite, um, it's not busy. So yeah, some of the actors 
didn't really like that because of course they don't have a, a, a queue lined up all day or people around there but for us it's it's like amazing because yeah. they just have time to talk like 10 to 15 minutes with you and usually you don't get that chance <laughs> especially with Sybil Denning we just really talk for a long time it's how we talk to a lot of people when we get of hell yeah. Friday yeah. is heaven <laughs> I mean for me it was the perfect day and oh we also talked um, about a new movie do you have that signed? Yes, um, yes, I have. One yeah, moment. there were also uh, some people there promoting a movie they're making. They were very and we nice, are by the way. Definitely going to look it up because, you know, they, they told us about their movie and how they are working on it, and they were so passionate. And I really, really love that when yeah. people are really passionate about something they're doing. And I think this may be may turn out to be something great. So we will look it up more and maybe also write about it. I think we will. Scars of Xavier. Yes. So there already were uh, some actors from the movie and the director and we talked to them and they, they signed uh, this already for us. So yeah, we couldn't be happier. It's always <laughs> what did so they nice. say? It, it, it's not worth anything now, but maybe in a few years. Yes. But for us, it's worth something now because yeah. if you're passionate about your work, we're passionate about you. And let's hope for them, <laughs> it's it's a big success. I mean, I they're see. really passionate about what they do. So <gasps> the autograph. Da, 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 da. And let's also show the picture of yes. Tommy Flanagan because it's open anyway. Yes, mine is in my room. So look at my face. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> That's my convention face. <laughs> so it was. It was a nice. It was yeah. pretty nice day. And we've got was... another one. Yes. Tomorrow. So tomorrow. more adventures to come tomorrow. I love you tomorrow. You're only a day. Oh, wait, Annie, no. <laughs> yeah, I know. But... <coughs> Come on, join me. Tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Tomorrow, I love you. We, we are in a hotel, tomorrow. by the way, just with other people in here as well. And yeah. it's like already 11.15. Okay, we should, we should go and drink something. Yeah, we should go and have a drink. So and then do this again tomorrow. Yeah. Be brave. Be brave. Tomorrow yes. we're gonna we have some more drop and uh, yes, true bravels, true bubbles, true bravels. So uh, yes.